This is going nowhere. Did the same thing here. Clips over here. So I don't know how he's doing back there. Hopefully he's doing okay. I'll see you later. They just can't handle my success on YouTube. You know, dogs have feelings too, right? We're not the only ones that want to ride on a motorcycle. Think they, they want to, right, Pico? You want to ride on a motorcycle? Actually, a few months ago, I started uh, training Pico. I ride with me on the motorcycle. Started with the Royal Enfield. Royal Enfield Classic 350, which is a very stable, quiet, smooth bike. He did pretty well. So I practiced with him like three or four times. He actually enjoyed it a lot. So I thought it was time to step up the game a little bit. See, the main goal is to get him to finally ride with me on my 2022 Lowrider ST Grey Ghost right here. But before we get to that noisy, shaky bike, I have to take him through a few steps. The next step as a transition from the Royal Enfield to the Harley is gonna be to ride on my 1989 Honda Goldwing GL 1500. This bike is way smoother than the Harley, obviously, but it's louder and noisier than uh, the Royal Enfield. So I think this transition between the bikes, Royal Enfield, the Honda Goldwing, and then the Harley. A few weeks ago, I was at uh, one of my bikes and breakfast events, and I saw over there, somebody came with his dog, Rocco. He had a great bag that he had to carry his dog. It's a bag made by Kemimoto, and if you uh, ride a motorcycle, you know who Kemimoto is. So I reached out to Kemimoto, and they were nice enough to send out the bag for me to try out. This is the bag. We're gonna try it out. Mount it somewhere over here on the bike, on the gold wing, and I'm gonna take Pico for his first ride. Let me show you the bag. This is the Kemimoto bag. Came folded, folded flat, and you built it up. Comes with all these additional straps. And let me show you something pretty cool. So, oh, I think, yeah, the bottom was folded like this. Folded down here, like that. then like that, and then like that. And then like that, and it all falls pretty small down there. Kemimoto, put it back together again. It's all waterproof over here. This bag is waterproof. A little cushion for Pico to sit in there. This canopy, for example, is an option. You can take it off and pop a net over here. Zipper, zipper in here, little air. These are flaps that if you want more air coming in, there's a net over here, literally a net. And if you don't want and it's cold, you just zip it down. And this is waterproof as well. Loops over here for straps to go all around. Again, more flaps with air venting coming in. And if it's too cold, close it down. Let me show you something also really cool. You can take the dog out from here as well. Zipper, and you can take, can take the dog out from here. Straps. If you have a sissy bar, it would go right here. You want to put it on the top instead of the canopy. Comes off. Take your canopy off. Put this net instead of the canopy and slide that back on. Obviously, it's got holes over here for air. All the extra stuff that you need. There's a rain, in case it's raining. You don't want to get your dog wet. Cover, to cover the bag. Waterproof your dog. For food and water that goes inside. And tons of straps to tie it down. I think I'm gonna place the bag right here in this area. So let me get the backrest off and then I'll be able to figure out where to connect all the straps right here. My neighbors wait, just wait to the second I take out my tripod and camera and they come out either to make noise or they call their uh, landscapers to make noise. They just can't handle my success on YouTube. Now I need to wait. I just need to wait till he finishes his blowing his, his leaves. Sorry guys, gonna have to wait a little bit. Put music on for you while you're waiting. Okay, I got the backrest off, but I just, I just, you know. Sorry, gotta wait. You kidding me? So I was able to strap it on. Five different strap styles with hooks 
and I just found the most convenient combination for me over here hooked it to the front and strapped it down nice and tight with a clip over here I loop over here on the top and there's also a loop on the bottom right here two clips ran it through here and tighten it down same thing on the other side this is going nowhere did the same thing here clips over here with the strap same thing strap coming in over here and two anchoring points over here and over here and now you can see carrying case for pico is ready maybe i'll actually open up over here so he gets to see me right here look this is what it looks like you see he can actually see me through the netting I'm taking pico for a walk I'm actually going to take him for a ride Let's bring him over. So we got we got Pico over here. You wanna come with me? We'll go on a motorcycle. Yeah? You wanna take a shit first? Listen, I got everything ready for you. Pico, come on, let's go over here. Let me put you look, I Hello. Let me take this off, okay? I'll close this for you, okay? <laughs> Pretty cool. Are you comfortable, Pico? Hey, Pico. We'll take you for a little ride, okay? I'll take you. I'll take you for a little ride, okay, Pico? Hey, Pico. <coughs> Silly. No, he sees the dog, huh? He sees the dog. Okay, he's back to himself. <laughs> I'll take you for a small ride, okay? Let's go, Pico. How you doing there, huh? Hey, Pico. You enjoying, Pico? This whole time, I'm yelling. He's doing okay. I'll see you later when you check the footage. I'll take you to a nice park where we can go and play, okay? Pico. Yeah, I stopped the bike, you see? Let me... Well, at the end, he was restless. A bit, uh, you know, he was not happy. I don't know. He was like squeaking and let me... Yeah. There we go. Hey, Pico. You're a bit scared? Yeah. Here we go. Let me take you out, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Lenny, I got you. I got you. I got you, good doggy. I got you. Now, let me get the there you go. There you go. How it's a familiar, a familiar place, right? He was scared at the end. He was shaking, but you know he'll get used to it. Hopefully, take him back very soon. Let him cool down, calm down. There you go, little Pico. There you go, little man. There you go. 
Well, he was restless at the end. I'll tell you what, when we ride, uh, when we drive with him in the car, he also is kind of restless. It takes him a good 10 minutes, 15 minutes till he calms down and goes. He sits on my lap and my wife's lap the whole time in the front when I'm driving. And then he calms down, eventually goes back to the seat and just relaxes. I guess it's a restless dog or being like the same as uh, when he was driving in the car is restless and giving me the <laughs> excited, very excited here in the park. I think it was worth your while, huh? Going with me on the motorcycle, huh, Pico? Pico, I'm talking to you. Yeah, you don't mind it that much, huh? Yeah. I'm here, Pico. Yeah. I'm here. Good dog. Yep. Hey, hey, hello. Hello, Pico. Hello, hello, hello. Good boy. Pico, go. Sandy, Sandy. Come on. Go. Good boy. Yay, good boy. I think he enjoyed it. I think you enjoyed it, right? He was like squeaking at the end, but he also does that when we go with the car. Let me tie you over here. This for you so you can guard the house a little bit. That's our guard dog. So did you enjoy yourself? So it's inconclusive if you enjoyed the ride itself, since he also is not extremely happy when he goes in the car. So it's, I would say it's pretty much the same on the bike. It's, he's, not, he's not afraid of the bike. It's just like the movement, I guess. He's not crazy about it, but eventually he quieted it down. So it was okay. That's it for now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. Pico, our brave dog right there, right now guarding the house, had a little fun day with me on this Kemimoto pet bag. So he backed himself. Yeah, 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 sure. What? Barking at him. What? Who are you barking at? Who? Okay, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. I'm Sandy. You're watching Holy Shift, guys. Till the next video. Peace out. You know, dogs have feet. Actually, a few months of a. Actually, a few months of. A... The next step is going to be actually. Enjoyed it a lot, so I, I, so I thought it was time to step. Pretty much, this is the part, uh, the bottom, and then it all pretty much was somehow uh, collapsed with the zippers. I don't remember how it was, but it collapsed. Hey, Buster. Talking to you. Answer, you idiot.